going on guys welcome back to another video and today we're going to be feeding my box turtles as you can see in the title of the video so let's do it <laughs> Right over here we have the enclosure. We have the box turtles just roaming around. We got one girl down there. But where's the other one at? I think she might be back there somewhere. You can see the top of her shell right over there. So what I usually like to do is I already changed their water, but they already got it dirty as you can see. Her right there, she's all wet. She just dunked herself in there. What I like to do is first grab this, so we're gonna just uh Put the phone up really quick so you guys can see what exactly it is I'm doing. So, what I like to do is grab this, pump it a few times, so it's nice and you're like compressing it kind of. So, once it's nice and tight or whatever, so like or you can't push it down that easy anymore, is when it's good, you just want to take it, press it, and just spray the enclosure. I like to do this to bring the humidity up and uh, they kind of like it too. It boosts up their like mating behaviors, just everything. So I like to go in, spray the entire enclosure really quick, get the back side over here too. So I'm probably gonna, oh she's already awake. I'm gonna spray her a bit. I just like to get the entire enclosure wet pretty much so that it's all nice and even kind of but once you go and spray everything is when I like to go and start feeding them because they all come towards me and you know just get riled up so what I'm gonna be feeding them today is these night crawlers that you can buy at walmart any bait shops or like sporting goods store that sells like fishing stuff so what i like to do is take it i also have a garbage right here too to dump out some of the dirt so i'm gonna grab my tweezers that i use to grab them get the phone down really quick and i'm gonna take this oh, oh my god almost you dropped through the camera but all right, we're gonna fix this really quick. All right, it should be good now. So we're gonna take this and open it up. And then you guys can see all these worms right there. So we're gonna take one. I usually like to get everybody in their own like little corner so that they don't fight each other for a worm. Let's see this girl, she's coming up with these guys. So I like to drop maybe one right there. First one's gonna grab it and run off with it. So then get her attention, give her one now. And then get this little guy over here, give one to him. And then, oh, she's gonna knock down the entire thing. And then give one to this girl. She'll grab it, there she is, let's see. Do it. Oh my god. There she goes. They're knocking over this entire like little hide. Try and put this towards the back side. Alright, that'll do it for now. But now we're gonna grab another one and feed the other female down here. Where is she? You see her just coming out of her little burrow. We're gonna go and place the worm right about there. You guys can see her. They instantly see it and instantly just attack them. These guys love these worms. They got their whole little feeding circle right there. But there's 12 in here, so I usually give two each and then just place two in random spots so whoever finds them gets them really. Just to make sure that they're all eating. This little guy right here. Put it in front of her. Grab another one. And then, oh, it fell. We're gonna go and feed the male another one. Just toss it over to him. And then, oh, these worms are disgusting. But protein is necessary for these box turtles, so 
Gotta do what you gotta do. Let's make sure your turtles are healthy. Come on. Can't grab them. Put them right there. Shall go after that one. And then we're gonna dig around. Find some more. Oh, this is a fat one right here. Drop them down there. And then just take the rest and just distribute them really. Just to make sure everybody gets at least two. And then I'll also go and throw a banana in later probably. These guys are doing good. They're feeding. They're, you know, active. They're breeding regularly now. Mating season is coming up really soon. So hopefully we get lots of eggs. So the point of having the garbage here is so that the excess dirt, I can just dump it out and then see if there's any worms hiding at the bottom or anything. I'll just go and scoop them up. But you can see there's nothing left. Just go throw this back in here and then we'll put everything away. This here, let me just put my garbage back. Back where it goes. And now, box throws are eating. They're doing good. Active, as you can see, everybody's moving around. They got misted. Probably spray a little more. Nope. We're gonna have to pump it up a little more. Do this one quick. That did not go as planned, but. Spray them up a bit more. That's pretty much it for feeding these guys. It's just as simple as that. Doesn't take a lot of time. Just a few minutes, and these guys are happy and healthy. So you can see the humidity is at 70 right now. Temperature on this side is 40. I mean, 74.8. This is their cooler side. We can just chill and. You know, Relax, and then right here is where we have the heat right there under those lamps. So I have the digital gauge down there. So right there, it's 85.8. So got the little warm side. They want to go to warm up, and they got many places to dig burrows and hide and get away from each other. And then they got their main little water bowl which they use all day, every day, and get it extremely dirty to where I have to clean it out so many times. These guys over here are also going crazy. So we're going to feed them. Try to get them some reserve. Grab a handful and just drop it all in. That big girl in there is so much that it's just, She's like a vacuum. She's crazy. The rest that we have in our hand, we're gonna go and feed to the snapping turtle, which is also getting an upgrade very soon. So stay tuned for that. He's getting huge. Love that little guy. But these guys are doing good. As you can see, they're all active. The temperature in the water right now is actually at 80. We got the little thingy right here. Forgot what it's called for a second. But I am going to be making a new dock for them too, so. Many more videos to come on all these guys. Make sure you guys subscribe and stay tuned. So that's going to be it for this video, guys. If you guys have any video suggestions or want to see more feeding videos like this in the future, leave a comment down below. Like, subscribe, and stay tuned for the next one. I also made a TikTok, so go follow that. Thank you.